What is going on you guys? So I thought I'd do a normal non-live stream video. Uh, I haven't done one in a while. Uh, and what I wanted to do... Oh, here's the winner of the giveaway. Hold on, let me give him his wheels quick. This was uh, Zane786 and he won the white ARA51s. Give these bad boys to him. And can, did you just cancel it? Oh, Chase has been completed. There you go, Zane. Alright. Okay. So. Um, so the video I wanted to do was the... Um, the Batmobile glitch, which I'm sure some of you already know about, but there's a lot of people that still don't. Um, so I don't know if you could already tell, but on the Octane DSR, I have the Batmobile wheels, and the only thing I really wanted from it is the Batmobile boost. Ah, oh, look at that. That is so cool. I've always, always loved the Batmobile boost. I mean, oh man, it just looks so sick. The noise it makes and everything. Um, I don't know if it's true, if it's just me being a little crazy, but... I feel like the Octane with this glitch does the Batmobile wobble. Um, it, I could just be losing my mind, but I could have sworn I've done it a few times since I've done this. Um, but anyways, let's get it right into it. Um, so I am not the founder of this glitch. Um, I'm just passing it on just because a lot of people don't know about it. Um, we'll try it on this one. So one of the glitches <clears throat> is... Uh, a two antenna glitch, which does not work in online mode, um, but this one's a lot easier. So all you have to do is press X on the one that you want, and then you want to press, if you're on PS4, X, L1, R1, L2, and R2, pretty much almost at the same time, um, except you want to do X, L1, and R1 at the same time, and then L2 and R2 at the same time. So, I mean, it's it's going to take you a few tries. It took me like 20 minutes just to get the uh, um, the Batmobile boost for the Octane. But for the Antenna Glitch, it's pretty easy. So, like I said, click the one you want. Hover over the one you want also on top of it. Do that combination. And boom. You got a little gingerbread man with the disconnect on there. Um, but like I said, unfortunately, it doesn't work in online mode. But other people will see it in a lobby. So, I mean, you know, you could get creative, have some fun with it. But uh, the one that is most important, hope, I mean, I, I really don't see a problem with the glitch. I mean, it's not like this glitch is helping people win more games. Um, it's just a different boost in different wheels. So, I mean, I, I hope they don't patch it just because it really doesn't make a huge difference. I don't think. I haven't noticed a huge difference with it. Um, and a lot of, I've talked to a lot of other people about it and they all say that, you know, it, it shouldn't be removed. It doesn't affect anything. Anyways, so what you wanna do, we'll do um We'll do the uh the ZSR with the Batmobile again, just because that that one's my favorite. But you could do this with the uh with the DeLorean, the Batmobile. I believe you could do it with the Sweet Tooth. I haven't tried it out yet. Um, if you're on Xbox, um, you could use the Xbox only cars on there. Um, so, and obviously like Aftershock, Esper, those, you could already use those wheels, um, and they don't have their own boost. But like I said, Sweet Tooth, um, Batmobile, DeLorean, you could get those wheels and their boost. So you could get, um, oops, no. You could get the DeLorean boost. It'll look exactly like that on any car you want. Same thing with the wheels. Um, and like I said, it is pretty tricky. But anyways, you're gonna do the same thing as you do with the antenna. Um, the same button combination, rather. Um, this is gonna take me a few tries, so try not to make fun of me. Um, so what you wanna do is click on the car that you want the boost to be on, and then you hover over either the Batmobile, the DeLorean, whichever boost you want. And then again, do the X, L1, R1, L2, and R2. Um, it's going to take you a few tries. 
Did I do it? Oh man, I thought I did it. <laughs> You'll know if you do it if um, there it'll kind of like glitch back and forth between the menus here. Um, let's try it again. I'll give it another few shots. If I can't do it, then like I said, it took me 20 minutes. But the uh, the button combination is just the X. L1, R1, L2, R2. Ah, man. It's like, I can't, the times that I did do it successfully, I can't even explain how I did it. Um, I literally just kept spamming all those buttons over and over until I finally got it. Um, ooh, did I do it? Okay, I can't see because there's a message in the way. Ooh, all right, there we go, Batmobile. So, literally all I did was press all the buttons at the same time, except the X you want to hit like a second earlier. Um, but anyway, see Batmobile wheels right here, and then got the Batmobile boost. Um, there are a few things that if you do, um, it'll get rid of the wheels. Um, I believe if you put on um, a mystery decal or anything like afterwards, I think you might be able to still change the color. So let's find out now so you guys don't get pissed if you do this afterwards. So it looks like you could change the colors, but I think if you put on a decal... Okay, yeah, see, look, when I hover over no decal, there's the Batmobiles. If I hover over uh, Biomass or Gobo or anything like that, it shows the regular wheels. Um, if you want a decal on this, I think all you have to do is, before you do the glitch, click on the car and then put on... I honestly don't know if the mystery decals will work, but for example, um, put on the Octane decal and then go back and do the same thing, and then it should work. Because, yeah, see, like, now the Batmobile wheels are gone. Um, but if you choose the decal first and then do it... Oh, of course, now watch. Hmm. Well, I, I proved to you guys that I could do it, so... You can't make fun of me now. Oh, they do it. Okay, there we go. Oh, but the decal isn't there. Okay, I could have sworn you could have used the decal, but I guess not. Um, if I'm wrong, just comment and correct me, but as you all just saw, I just tried putting on the Octane decal and it did not work. And then if you change your decal, um, you'll get, you'll lose the Batmobile wheels and the boost. But anyways, now you got a funny looking car, but like I said, the uh, the Batmobile wheels and boost you could use in an online match. I really hope Psyonix doesn't take it down because it. I don't think it's causing any harm to anybody. And plus, I mean, I'm a, I'm a huge fan of the Batmobile boost. Wheels I could do without, but uh, the boost I definitely like a lot. Um, but anyways, I'm going to wrap it up for this video. Um, also, just a heads up coming up, we're going to do a huge, huge, huge crate opening. Um, so if anyone would like, only if they would like to donate crates, um, just send me a message on PS4. You can see my PSN in the bottom left. Um, only if you want to. I'm going to try to do a huge, huge crate opening. Um, I see everyone else on YouTube doing like over a thousand, not that much, but definitely only like a hundred or something like that. Cause I need to make up for my last hundred CC4 video where <laughs> I got only like two painted wheels or something like that. Um, so I definitely need a redemption at that. Anyways, this is going to be it for this video. Peace out, guys. Much love.